So here is my rant for a change and for the very first time in my entire life I am craving a selfie stick because my arms are simply not long enough. Okay, so my rant for change is very simple. It's to make your gardens hedgehog friendly. We know that the hedgehog population in this country is suffering a catastrophic decline. The population has declined by around 37% in the last 10 years. Um, it's possibly declined by over 90% since the 1950s. We don't have those early data in any particularly robust form. This is serious. This is a really big problem. Uh, because the hedgehog is a magical, amazing creature. It's an opportunity, if you have a hedgehog in your garden, of allowing, in particular, young people to get nose-to-nose -nose with a truly amazing, charismatic, beady-eyed carnivore. Something which is as big as 90... as bigger than, sorry, bigger than 99% of all other wildlife that has ever lived on the planet. It's in the top 1% with us and the blue whale and the Tyrannosaurus rex. You know, this is a marvel of evolution. We should treasure our hedgehogs. The reason why the hedgehog population is declining and how we can fix it, well, we've got more than two minutes worth there. Uh, suffice it to say, if we're going to tackle it in any really big sense, we probably need to dismantle industrial capitalism, which is a bit beyond the remit of this one short message. But for now, let's look at the bits that we can deal with. Our own gardens. Make them wildlife friendly. Don't just make them friendly for those boring things, beginning with the letter B, like birds and bats and butterflies and bees. Let's make them friendly for stuff which is exciting like toads, like hedgehogs, like mice, like voles, like newts, all of these other amazing animals which we tend to neglect. And how do we do that? Well, go to our website, the Hedgehog Street website, have a look at all of the information we've got there, become a hedgehog champion. But the most important thing is, if these wonderful, snuffly, creepy, crawly creatures can't get in, they won't get in. So make sure there are holes in fences. And that is my rant. That is my rant. Make a hole in your fence, make your garden fr friendly for wildlife, and if you're lucky, let a hedgehog into your life. Thank you very much.